what does a timing belt do? So a timing belt is a toothed belt that runs around the camshaft and the crankshaft. The whole system runs on these toothed gears called sprockets. And what happens is the camshaft controls the valves, so the valves move in and out, and the crankshaft's connected to the piston that moves up and down. If these two systems are not timed together, if a valve is out and a piston is up, they can meet in the middle and hit each other on what we call an interference engine. So the whole point of a timing belt system is to make sure that the valves and the pistons don't meet in the middle and that they are timed together. Two other things that frequently run on the timing belt because they are critical for the safe operation of the vehicle is the water pump. We obviously want coolant to flow around the engine whenever the engine's on, otherwise we may overheat and damage the engine. Also behind the crankshaft is normally our oil pump. And again, we want oil to flow when the engine's running, otherwise obviously the, uh, the friction of having no oil will end up causing the engine to seize up. Most time belts have an idler pulley, which is just a smooth pulley, keeps it under tension. And then we actually have the tensioner on the other side. So tensioners are either mechanical, so spring loaded, or they are hydraulic tensioners and they usually use engine oil to do that. In these systems, it's really important to make sure that your engine oil is topped up. Any lowering of engine oil levels below half may begin to make your tension lose tension on the belt. Ideally, we're looking for about half an inch worth of deflection maximum. Any more than that, and you may skip a tooth and potentially damage your engine. Hope that makes sense, and I'll see you in the next one.